the product on the brush because I used it with the cream brush today. I used this brush to, with the cream blush today. Hey guys, welcome back. So I've got a little show and tell on another IT Cosmetics QVC Today Special Value. These are always really good, really exciting, and this one is no different. This is the New Year Your Most Beautiful Skin Six Piece Collection. Really pretty packaging and presentation. The outside is a regular cardboard box, but then the inside is really pretty. This is actually printed on the box. Each of the products has their own little home, which I really appreciate. Um, you do get a little pamphlet that tells you some information about the different products you're getting in this set, so I always like those little details. And like the QVC Today's special values are, this is a one day special price. So January 16th, this is going to be at a special price. I'm not sure of the exact price as of right now, but as soon as I know the price and have the link for it, I'll list those down below for you. But I do know that these are always a really good value. So I'm sure it's gonna be a really great price. But anyway, um, I'm just gonna run through the different products. I've been trying these out, so I'm gonna give you some little like mini reviews and just my thoughts and opinions on them. So let's jump into it. So first off, you get one of my favorite brushes from IT Cosmetics. This is called the Heavenly Luxe Dual Ended Complexion Perfection Brush. Really long name, really great brush. Um, it's just like a dual ended kind of, I feel like it's a multi-purpose type of a brush. I mean, it's great for foundation, but I've also used this for blush. I've used it for bronzer. It's just kind of like, it reminds me of the um, Sephora Multitasker brush, where it's just one of those great kind of multi-function type of brushes. That's what this is. And then you also get the other side that's kind of more like a concealer type brush, and this is really great too, but you could also use this for eyeshadow as well, applying cream shadow, powder shadow, anything. Um, it's just a great multitasking kind of a brush. I love this one. And I was really excited to see that this was included in this set. You know, the compact foundations are like all the rage right now. So I was just really excited to see that IT Cosmetics has one now too, because I feel like if they do it, it's gonna be great for your skin. It's gonna have really good ingredients and just a really good version of a cushion foundation. So I was excited to see that they have one and it's in the set. So you get the foundation compact and then also a refill. And I received these in Fair, which does work really well. Um, sometimes Fair in It Cosmetics can be a little bit light on me. I can make it work, but I kind of, sometimes I'm more, a little bit more Fair, but most of the time I'm more light in their line. But the Fair works really well for me. I think that it matched really well. So that's what I'm wearing on my skin today. So the box says something different, so I don't know if they renamed it or what. The box says the CC Plus Veil Beauty Fluid Foundation SPF 50 Plus, but then the little um, pamphlet says the CC Plus Veil Cushion Compact Foundation. So let me show you this. So it comes in the mirrored packaging and then you just pop it open and the inside of it looks like the other cushion foundations that I've used, that the little sponge sits on top and then it has the little like opener dealy. Um, my sponge is dirty because I did use it today. I use this with both the sponge and then also I tried it with this brush. I already own this brush, so I use the one that I already own. And I liked it both ways. Now, something I did notice about this one, it has a different, let me show it to you. It has a different feeling and different sort of formula than the other cushion foundations I've used because I've used the L'Oreal True Match Lumi True match dream lumi i don't know true match lumi something cushion foundation and then also the physician's formula who knows what that one's called because they have ridiculously long names so i've used both of those and those feel more like liquidy and so when you press the sponge into them it really like picks up a lot of liquidy product on the sponge really quickly whereas this one i really had to press more into it because it feels more like a silky feeling regular foundation. So I really do like the formula on this one. And first first coat I would say it was more kind of light to medium coverage, but then it built up nicely to more of like a medium sort of a coverage. Um, it has a really natural look on the skin, kind of like a natural sort of, not super dewy, but just a very natural look on the skin is how I would describe it. But I really do like it. But just know you may have to press into it a little bit more because it's not nearly as liquidy, at least to those other two that I've tried. I haven't tried all the cushion foundations that are out, but at least those other two, 
those are way more liquidy than this one is, but I really do like this one a lot. You get the CC Plus Vitality Brightening Cream Blush. This is in a new shade. This is in Je ne sais quoi. This one I've got on my cheeks today. This is just the most girly, sweet, natural looking blush. Um, again, it's in that really reflective packaging, so there's really no way I can show you like dead on without really blinding you. So I'm just gonna show you like this. But Je ne sais quoi is, I feel like it's that color in IT Cosmetics line that just is very fresh looking, very natural, but still gives you color to your face really just makes you look healthy and alive without looking overdone. So I love that they did the cream blush in Je ne sais quoi. And it's just a really pretty, I don't know, it's a pink, but it's not, mm, I don't know, it's that kind of warm sort of a pink. It's got a warmth to it. Now I'll tell you, I'm really not that big on cream blushes, but I do really like IT Cosmetics ones. I feel like theirs, just don't get as patchy. I feel like they blend really well. So I feel like cream, as far as cream blushes go, I think IT Cosmetics makes some of the best ones that just apply really easily. They blend it into the skin really nicely. They're just easier to work with. So I like their cream blushes. And this one just blends in so nicely and it has like a little bit of like a sheen to it on the cheeks, but it's not shimmery and it really, I mean, looking at it in the pan, it doesn't look that way, but I don't know, something about getting it on my skin, it looked like just a little bit dewy and fresh. So really pretty. And you get another brush in this set. This is the Angled Radiance Cream Brush. And I did use this today, so it's tinted a little bit pink. I tried to do a little like quick wash of it, but it still has a little bit of like a pinky tint to it. But this is what it looks like. Let me show you over here where you can see it. So it's a fairly large um, brush, but I found it was easy to work with. I really did like this brush. So it's kind of that duo fiber sort of a situation. What I did do to kind of be able to get the product on the brush, because I used it with the cream brush today. I used this brush to, with the cream blush today. And what I did <laughs> is I kind of like pinched it so that it was a little bit denser. And then I rubbed it in the, I'm struggling, in the blush. <laughs> and then I put it on my cheeks and that worked really well. So I think that helps to kind of get the product on the brush is if you kind of squeeze it to make it a little bit denser. But then I found that it just blended so nicely on the skin, like it really does apply the brush. <laughs> the blush, why can I not say this correctly? Applies the blush really nicely and it's very soft. IT Cosmetics makes some great brushes. I love them. This is a really nice one. That was so difficult for me to speak in that little part. <laughs> lastly, you get the Blurred Lines Smooth Fill Lipstick, and it's in a new shade, Je ne sais quoi again. I have this on my lips today. This is a really nice lipstick formula and a really pretty shade. Again, Je ne sais quoi, that never fail ya, every day sweet, natural looking color, girly, I love it. This smells like a MAC lipstick, so much, like exactly like a MAC lipstick. So yummy, that vanilla scent. It's really comfortable on the lips, very moisturizing. I think this is the first time for me to try this um, Blurred Lines lipstick formula from them, and I really like this. It just feels so comfortable and of course, I love Je ne sais quoi, so I'm really excited about this lipstick. All right, guys, so that was a little look into this set. I love it. I think it's a great set. I love the products inside. Really nice quality. I would definitely recommend it. So hope that you really enjoyed this video and hope it was helpful for you. Please give it a thumbs up if it was. Let me know down below if you have any questions for me. I'm happy to answer those. Please subscribe to my channel if you're not already, and I'll see you in the next video.